to me and you've just rung the bell at Lord's on for the Sunday. How did it feel? Mind-blowing, really. Uh, Mind-blowing to come here, to play here, uh, to be a member here is uh, astonishing. But, uh, yeah, to, to have that honour that you've seen people do time after time. Because as a player, you sit up there and you wait for that sound and you know that that's the moment to really switch on. So today, hopefully, I've made New Zealand switch on, big time. <laughs> And you like being here at Lords and commentating up from that. Listen, this is the home for even though we we live twenty thousand miles or whatever away, uh, this is the official home of cricket. Uh, it's hello turf for us, um, and, and it's uh, so few New Zealand cricketers try uh, have tried and succeeded to get here and play here. So, in, in a sort of a sentimental and serious way, uh, it, it's it's a realization of something special here. Yeah. And um, you, you know, you've obviously played here, but but to, but to commentate is that is that great as well? Well, uh, you know, you look at the calibre of people you work with up there. You know, you, you've got Sir Ian Botham, you've got David Gow, you've got all former England captains, Hussain, uh, you've got you know uh, Atherton, the new breed, and then you throw in uh, the class and, and the beautiful voice of Michael Holding. I mean, how bad can it be? Uh, you've got one of the best views in the house of of, uh, of world cricket, uh, be it an, albeit a more modern view than than they get at the at the members' end, but. How good, how good and get paid. <laughs>